Hi everyone and welcome to the campus of Villanova University, just a few miles west of the great city of Philadelphia. I'm Harry Chickma here for another interesting World Team Tennis Showdown between Sacramento and the Philadelphia Freedoms. And we're here with a legend, James Blake, competing yet again for Billie Jean King's team, the Freedoms. How does it feel to be playing for BJK here in this great city? Uh, it's an honor. Um, you know, any, anything associated with her is really a privilege to be a part of. Um, you know, I'm just happy I've gotten a chance to meet her and, and uh, what she's done for the sport and what she's done for team tennis is really incredible so proud to be a part of it how about the competition it is very intense you're going up against a tough team tonight yeah I've heard they've won it quite a few times so we'll have to try to take them out on, here on opening night uh, I know the Philly fans will get behind us um, but it, it should be a good one and uh, I'm looking forward to uh, we got a good team so we'll uh, we'll have a good chance I think well, James great seeing you best of luck thanks a lot appreciate it a lot of excitement tonight here outside of Philadelphia Harry Chick with James Blake we'll be right back with more world team tennis excitement James Blake from America, one of the legendary players from the USA, now playing in the final event of the evening. He will face another American, Alex Kuznetsov from Sacramento. And this won't be an easy task. I mean, many tennis fans might wonder who is Alex Kuznetsov? I mean, how can this guy beat the great James Blake? Well, Kuznetsov has been around for quite a while. He's played in all the Grand Slam events. He's won matches in the Grand Slam events. He's a legend from this region in the juniors, the middle states, so not as easy as you may think. And they both, both train together as well in the Florida area. So this is definitely a competitive, professional matchup with Blake facing Kuznetsov. A uh, tough call there, so we will replay that point. Blake now serving the first game of the men's singles event. Down love one. If you're just joining us, World Team Tennis plays five events. Scoring for each event is up to five. So it's a set up to five, no ad scoring. And James Blake being aggressive there, but he hits the backhand in the net. So in a little bit of a hole here in his opening service game. Love two. Kuznetsov letting Blake off the hook there, had a great passing shot opportunity approaching the net, but that goes bottom of the net. So James is on the board here in men's singles. It is new all here. And you can see that Alex really likes that inside out forehand approach. So James will try to work the backhand as much as possible. Blake, best known for his huge forehand and speed. And he works the big forehand there. So now three points in a row for the Harvard grad. A game point now for Philadelphia. And you can hear the fans appreciating the effort. That one just nicks the corner of the line. So we are now in a no ad scoring situation, three all. Winner of this point gets the first game. Oh, Kuznetsov flicking the wrist and what a winner from the baseline. He gets the break of serve. You can sense the fans willing their marquee star, James Blake, really wanting a victory, if nothing else, for morale. Blake definitely dug deep in the mixed doubles, played excellent tennis, but he has to do even more now if he wants his team to come out with a victory here with men's singles. Big serve for Alex, one love. Another big serve. 
out wide to the Blake backhand, too tough to handle. Really uh, not expecting such big serving tennis from Kuznetsov. He's known for his grinding game, but looking sort of like Pete Sampras out here. An ace up the tee, four points in a row now. Sacramento in strong control of 19-11 overall and two love here in the men's singles event. The pressure back on James Blake. This is his seventh year of WTT excitement. He played for Hartford and Boston. He was the rookie of the year back in 2000. He's been ranked as high as number four in the world, also has 10 ATP singles titles on his resume. He's gonna have to dig deep with some experience right now. And that was some great baseline play from James Blake, dictating play with his huge forehand. It was really the inside-out forehand to that Alex Kuznetsov backhand that opened up the court. This is what the fans paid for. Heavyweight tennis here at Villanova. Three love now for Blake, a game point. Just what he needed for the confidence. Another awesome forehand for Blake. Taking that one over the shoulders and just pounding it. Just outside of Philadelphia, on the campus of Villanova University, it's James Blake taking on Alex Kuznetsov. The freedoms of Philadelphia facing the Sacramento Capitals. Oh, that's excellent play from Alex Kuznetsov. Going up the line for the forehand put away. Really set it up nicely with the kick serve as well. Oh, unbelievable backhand from Blake. That is the epitome of threading the needle. Got nice and low and flicked his wrist for the cross court put away. Still 2-1 though for the Capitals. Two points away from holding serve and taking a 3-1 lead. Talk about a hometown bounce from the net. Second straight backhand winner for James. You figured when you're playing in Philadelphia for the Freedoms and you're James Blake, you deserve that bounce. Wow. James Blake is starting to feel the range. Awesome pickup off the backhand. 
Looked like he hit that with his fingers. So now all of a sudden, two break points to get back on serve here. does it courtesy of some amazing shots Blake has this one tied at two in men's singles a couple high fives from the sidelines and Philadelphia is very much alive here in the final event of the night <laughs> 